Hello and welcome to Droidbox. In today's video we will be unboxing and demonstrating the brand new Droidbox Go V3 Mini Projector. Inside we have a carry bag for the projector. The projector itself which will show more detail in a moment. There's a user manual which is in full English. And inside there is all the accessories. So we have a tripod for the projector. A USB charger. An HDMI cable. Remote control. As a note, this isn't a infrared remote, it's a wireless remote. So you don't have to point it at the projector for it to use it. So onto the projector itself, so you have a touch panel for your controls uh, for the navigation. On the side is the HDMI input, power input, two USB ports, the on off button and on the other side you've got the micro SD slot and the focus dial. On the bottom you have the screw hole for the tripod and there's also a flap here that you can use to raise the front of the projector. So what we'll do next is show you a demonstration of the projector. Please note there is some flickering and changes in the colour. This is due to the video camera recording not synchronising and is not the actual output of the projector. The home screen features shortcuts to commonly used apps such as Netflix, YouTube, Google Play Store, HDMI input and settings. You can add more apps to the shortcut bar at the bottom. The Go V3 runs on Android 5 and is Kodi 17 ready. It does come with Kodi 16 but you can update it in a moment or two to the latest version via the Google Play Store. In this demo we are showing clips from trailers of forthcoming films. As you can see the quality is very clear and bright. You can also use the HDMI input to connect your PC or laptop, set top box, Blu-ray player or even another droid box up to it. What we particularly like is that the remote control is not infrared but is now wireless. So you do not have to point directly at the projector to use the remote. The Go V3 keystone correction improves over the V2 with both automatic and manual keystone correction. If your V3 is going to be fixed to a ceiling mount for example, you can manually adjust the keystone and you should not need to change it again. If you use it in a variety of different places and at different heights, then the automatic keystone works great for ease and speed. The Go V3 improvements over the V2 such as keystone features, wireless remote, Android 5, 2 gigs of RAM and 16 gigs of storage make this a great solution for everything from a portable cinema experience to work presentations. You can find out more information on the Go V3 by clicking the link in the description.